Hello friends, welcome to Testing Shala YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to learn about Agile Testing Estimation Techniques. So in this video, I am going to discuss about three important testing estimation. Before proceeding further, if you have visited Testing Shala YouTube channel for the first time, then please click on subscribe and click on bell notification so that all our future videos related to software testing will be your will be in your inbox that would help you to enhance your software testing skills. So let's move on to understand what are those three important test, test estimation techniques that you can use in your agile testing projects. Let's understand one by one testing technique. The first important testing technique in agile testing is t-shirt sizing. This is a one testing estimation technique where we will be using t-shirt sizes for the estimation. So normally this t-shirt sizing estimations will be done if your testing project is a very large project. If you are the project which you are going to implement is very large project and if it is having multiple scrum teams then we will go for t-shirt sizing. So the t-shirt sizing will be done based on the t-shirt sizes, the excess, S, medium, large, extra large. So these are the some of the terminologies will be used when you are performing the estimation for t-shirt sizing. The sizes and their efforts, everything will be defined as part of the mutually collaborated way. Every project can have different uh, sizes or the outcome of the sizes can be vary in every project, but we should define ourselves before going into the boardroom where we are going to estimate. We should clearly call, call that out, what is the di different sizes all about. I am going to give an example how it can be defined in an effective way, in a more collaborated way. The size is XS, S, M, L and XL. So time required if, if any is a story which is of excess, the implementation can take one to three weeks and with one person and the cost could be 5k k to 15k which are in dollars. Again simple uh, user stories can be able to take to implement one to, five, one to two months which requires a person one to five and again the cost is here. In the same way for every t-shirt sizing, it is a clear definition of what is the time required and with the associated resources and what is the cost involved in implementing that kind of user stories. This table gives clear idea of how we are using t-shirt sizing for doing agile test estimation. So let's move on to the second type of agile testing estimation technique is story point which is also called as a story point sizing. The story points here are tied to man hours. The story points are tied to hours. So in story point sizing normally we use the Pibernicki sequence for every point that is the Pibernicki series will be 0, 1, 2, 3, 5, 8, 13, 21, 34 like that which will make it exponential and close to the t-shirt sizing. Story points will be used when we are doing estimation using agile planning poker. That is when we use story point method. Next agile test estimation technique is work hours. Here we go with the gut feeling and we will go with the everything in terms of work hours. In this case where points are translated to hours, the team uses hours indirectly. Some teams prefer hours over points because it allows them to know how long a person will have to work on this on a more realistic way. So here we are directly use work hours in place of any story points. Very easy for us to perform an estimation by using directly the work hours. I hope you understood all the three important test, test estimation technique in Agile projects. One is one 
one is t-shirt sizing and story pen work covers these are the three important test estimation technique will be used in estimating in agile testing projects hope you understood clearly what are these three important testing estimation techniques i hope you enjoyed watching this video if you like this video please click on like button and if you have visited testing shala youtube channel for the first time then click on subscribe button and bell notification so that all our future videos related to software testing will be in your inbox that would help you to enhance your software testing skills thanks for watching this video bye for now take care